Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. I'm Marabus and in this video I will show you uh, what I do every time I log in into the game for the first time of the day. So basically this is uh, Sunday's run and I will try to make every Sunday video of my gameplay. This uh, video will be a little bit longer than others because there's plenty of stuff to do. And just to give you some heads up, uh, I already watched some videos, uh, commercials over my phone, so I got some uh, rewards, like uh, extra 10 points, uh, skill points, upgrades for the heroes, I don't know, uh, watched 15 uh, movies, uh, videos here to get 3 these seals, on. then I watched the video to get 10 then uh, fortune tickets, uh, what else, watched video to get 3 extra attacks on the tower, as you can see 30 out of 27, watched video, 3 videos to get uh, bestian attack, uh, what else, Very for what, and that's it about videos, yeah, I watched 3 videos to get uh, three, 3 coins over here, for Alliance uh, Battle Pass and another heads up uh, you might notice that I have some some things uh, unlocked that maybe you don't have like automatic uh, attacks uh, in almost all the battles that's because I have some perks unlocked uh, because I bought some stuff with real real life money as you can see, I have few subscriptions uh, active for uh, for uh, gems, uh, diamonds, and for for the energy. And this is the only four that I let's say constantly have active. And those uh, subscriptions gives me uh, VIP points, which uh, gives me this VIP status. You start with VIP 1 and progress as you gather more VIP points, you progress through the levels. As you can see here, you have VIP benefits and regardless, uh, each level uh, gives you some uh, progress towards some uh, benefits. Uh, let me just give the first one, what's great uh, about VIP. Uh, VIP gives a lot of opportunities and gives you more uh, things to do in the game faster. Also, it gives you opportunity to buy more purchases, purchases but those purchases cost uh, diamonds and I don't usually use them. I use maybe one or two, depending on what. As you can see, uh, purchases... Uh, I mean levels, daily energy purchase is 14 for uh, level 13, but I'll give you only the best one. As you can see, this one, multiple auto battle functions. Most of you don't have this, and I can't remember now on at which level you get that. Uh, also, let's see, uh, maximum amount of accumulated hero skill points. At some point, uh, I don't know which level, 14, 15, will give me 30. So, uh, waiting for that to happen, instead of the usual 20 that we all have. Uh, let's see. Ability to keep merchant ship forever for gems, yeah. You buy, you will have an opportunity to buy it once. It costs, I don't know, 400 or 600 diamonds, and you have permanently there. Also, pirate ship, which costs, I think, 1000 gems, and you have permanent, it's permanent there. Uh, and this this one is good. Number of spaces is Alliance Mercenary Camp 3. Uh, everyone who doesn't buy anything has only two. Extra gold in Expedition. As you can see, on level 13, I will get 50% more. At the moment, I don't have any extra gold bonus. So, waiting for this one to happen. Uh, X, uh, double speed is, is available. That's great. And you can see purchase is 42 for daily treasures. I'm, I'm not using those. I don't use almost any of these 
purchase it because they're expensive. A lot of the diamonds requires to buy them. Free wish chest, uh, yeah, that's something. It's okay, but it's once per week. Uh, purchases for portal then doesn't matter. Daily refresh is nothing. Uh, number of daily attention. Uh, expedition purchase this is great but it's expensive 300 diamonds per per attempt uh, let's see what else it's great double bonus chest reward for watching the final ad video that's for daily videos the last one gives double reward that's good it's not great reward but it's good instant battle is in expedition this is the great one because there are plenty of uh, battles in expedition and with these options uh, i finish expedition very shortly you will see uh, instant battles in tower same thing then as in expedition great uh, instant battle in alliance raids also great you'll see not in this video because i don't have a raid uh, at the moment active maybe next sunday uh number they were dungeon nothing instant battle in dungeon this is great also every instant battle is great and instant battle with alliance both great and purchases purchases not uh, important at least not to me so basically if you're gonna spend some uh, some money it doesn't matter what uh, amount is it eventually your vip status will progress and you will unlock uh, better and better let's say rewards not rewards perks so for me like i said i only use these four uh, energy is always great and some diamonds i'm not the buying all of these subscriptions this is just enough for me as much as i spent uh, per day and gain the more uh, from the chests uh, I'm constantly around this, this number. Okay, let's see what we do first. Okay, we go for the events. Check uh, what events are coming up. So, in 16 hours, bonus energy, not important at the moment. Bonus expedition coins in 16 hours, not important. Tournament in one day, not important. Why I'm doing this? Uh, because if I see some event uh, starting in, I don't know, a few hours, uh, depending which kind of event, let's say uh, event hunting quantums begins in three hours, then I would uh, wouldn't uh, collect any chests at all, no matter where they are found, uh, because in chests I get quantums. I would wait for the event to start and then start uh, collecting those chests, like arena chests, uh, expedition chests, uh, tower defense chests i would hold on to them also i wouldn't buy quantums for the from the store on dungeon arena expedition tower i would wait so i hope you understand what i'm trying to say first check uh, what uh, events are coming this day and like i said quantums uh, uh, quantums uh, events are uh, when quantum events start uh, will start in few hours or that day depending on when you log into the game. Wait, wait we're with collecting your stuff. Okay, that's it. Firstly, let's uh, re uh, use skill points. As you can see, most of my heroes are at the maximum of level uh, for skill points. So basically, I'm looking first hero that isn't maximum. And no, 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 I skipped one. Sorry. It's more up. I know there's some hero yeah near and rich uh, i have 30 because i got extra 10 uh, from watching a video uh, you can watch video go to the doesn't matter which hero just click on hero and click here and you will have options to get extra 10 by watching one video and i can always just upgrade 10 by 10 uh, skill points okay hero upgrade complete yeah now as you can see on daily task it got upgraded claim i said uh also 
if there isn't active uh supremacy points uh supremacy rewards uh event uh, usually it doesn't show up uh, on upcoming events what that means uh, at the moment it's a uh, live that event uh, but if it isn't uh, active i would recommend not to collect uh, not to collect uh, these uh, rewards from daily task you go and finish them just don't collect collect them later on on the day maybe on your last login into the game uh, because sometimes it's just pop-ups that supermaster reward event is it has started so basically what that means if you collected all the daily rewards uh before and then it starts you won't get uh these extra five points per per uh, daily quest fin that you finished so if it wasn't active i would leave or finish all the quests uh, here and just leave it to stay until my last login into game when i come to my last, uh, last login into game i check if it event is active if not collect if it's active also collect and you uh, then you will get those super points since it's active at the moment i can collect it immediately extra five points for for, uh, for there like i said uh keep your points uh collected until the last day of the event and then choose which path to take okay daily quests you need to conquer uh, campaign missions uh you have five missions on hard difficulty and uh three uh, three missions uh, three campaign episodes on expert difficulty i always uh, first do five uh, runs with hard and all other missions i'm doing on expert every other as you want to see but firstly let's collect a uh, chest uh, as you can see you have three chests over here per day so once per hour i open the chest once every hour i open the chest and you need five chests to complete daily uh, quest okay chest is done let's finish dungeon for daily quest now you'll see how automatic thing uh, works i only attack once maybe twice per day and that's it i put my heroes here oh wrong pet yeah okay as you can see i have automatic options and my attack on dungeon is done open chest and that's it i finished dungeon oh yeah nice for completing level 240 i got a reward then go to the store since i have since it's uh, alliance event active that uh, for hunting quantums i can collect quantums already i always spend all all my coins on dungeons since i'm doing only one or two runs there's not plenty of coins left there you can complete more runs per day if you want yeah uh forgot to collect here collect this collect energy and also one thing i didn't mention to say uh, when you're getting to level up if you are close for uh, for me it's sixteen thousand experience uh, difference so it doesn't matter at this point but when you're getting close uh, and you are playing on your computer switch to your mobile phone and collect uh, uh, level up over there so, because when you level up uh, you will get uh, also uh, options to watch a video where you get extra energy in uh, each time you level up doesn't matter pc or or mobile or your phone you will get energy but what with watching uh, another uh, adver advertisement video you will get even more energy so uh all the time i play and i see i'm getting close to like i don't know 50 experience still needed to level up uh i switch to my phone do their mission or something that gives me 50 experience and watch a video to get even more energy okay we finish that let's continue we finish the dungeon merchant ship as you can see i have it active and what do i buy here i buy all the time uh, experience points but for credits only 
sometimes there are for diamonds i skip those and anything i'm not buying things for diamonds in shops uh, and all the upgrades uh, or for enhancements or doesn't matter which kind as, uh, as, the, as long as they are for coins i check if i have more than 200 if i have more than 200 i don't buy if i have less than 200 i buy them but i said uh, let's say uh, what's the maximum amount of coins i'm paying so basically all the offers that are lower than 1 million as you can see this costs 5 million i skip that but this one is uh, lower than 1 million i check I have more than 200 no i'm not buying let's check this one more than 200 not buying more than 200 not buying this is more than 1 million nothing nothing okay let's go to the marketplace as you can see uh, this uh, dot blue dot uh, represents that i definitely need this item for upgrading some hero and it costs less than two, uh, 1 million and uh, i have less than 200 i'm buying that for for, for 480,000 uh, coins more than 200 not buying more than 200 not buying less than 200 buying less than 200 buying more than 200 more than 200 well, definitely expensive uh less than 200 buying more than 200 less than 200 buying and every time buy all three these potions every time you have an opportunity it's the prices stay the same constantly so buy buy this maximum each uh, this giant experience gives uh, 3000 points just buy them every time you're gonna need them for your heroes as you can see i have free refresh it's also perk that i get, uh, got with vip status and re let's refresh and do another run more than 200 less than 200 buying i know that i have two, more than 200 of these more than 200 of this okay let's check this one a little bit more uh definitely under more more too expensive uh, yeah buying more than 200. and more potions also uh, since i have plenty of diamonds i do one refresh per day for 50 points okay more buying potions uh, more than 200 not buying less than 200 buying more not buying not buying oh, over 1 million not buying i have more than 200 of this this little bit more little bit more 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 okay merchant shop is done what's next yeah go to arena let's activate another chest uh in 43 minutes this uh, chest of souls with appear i have more than one to complete and that's most of the time my last thing i do in uh, my runs of the game you know what's that collect 35 souls uh, through our arena and you get purple chest reward some will have one chest with perks you can get more i have i don't know three or four chests so basically but uh, basically that means i need to do let's say 104 140 kills per day uh let's check the store yeah uh buying the amount of quantums it's all up to you but those points go goes down very quickly also as you can see i have three of those active uh, possible to buy uh, i'm not spending arena points on items i'm spending them all on quantums uh, i go i don't know like two up to 300 as you can see all my points are gone okay that's it enough for this but i have free refresh and i only doing free refresh i'm not doing uh, for 50 diamonds as i said that free refresh is from one of those perks i mentioned at the start of the video 
I refresh because I will, let's say, was done with first three uh, buyings of quantums. Almost all three were at 300. That's why I refreshed. Usually I wait till I'm all three on 300. Okay, uh, quantum event is active. Those events for the cards or this at this moment seals, this one uh, is active. So you can start collecting your chest. Uh, also, if you see some of the event uh, with cards is gonna be active later on, also save your chest, like arena chest, expedition chest. Save them because in those chests you get those seals or cards or whatever they are called for that event. And as you know, for uh, Wheel of Fortune, you get this uh, fortune tickets from the arena chest, as you can see. From arena chest so that means if you're gonna if you see that a wheel of fortune is going to come up in few hours in the events upcoming events those bottom three are upcoming events save arena chest since it's active in the moment i can collect my arena chest as you can see six fortune tickets and one seal and plenty of other stuff okay now i'll show you another perk that i have I have opportunity to open uh, any chest two times uh, per day for free. But I'm not spending those these keys on small chests. I'm spending them on gold and better ones. So I have one royal chest open with key. Yeah, 10 points, uh, 10 fortune tickets and one seal. Also, I forgot to mention, if you see that event called Alliance uh, Alliance Boss, it's called Alliance Boss, let me check, yeah, Alliance Boss, if this event is gonna come up in a few hours, uh, also save your uh, Alliance, uh, save your, yeah, uh, Arena Chess, save your Arena Chess, because uh, in every Arena Chess uh, that you open, you will get attack points for this boss, you can have like five maximum attacks per uh, accumulated so save uh, your arena chest if you see that the uh, event is coming up yeah there's a lot of things you need to check first before you start playing okay we are done with arena okay 55 minutes to unlock this chest okay let's wait with that one let's go to the tower now firstly uh i know Every day I'm getting to 100 keys at least, maybe 150. So I'm leaving these uh, amounts staying there, amounts of coins uh, and uh, credits and stuff. So people would attack me uh, more. You want to people to attack you as much as possible so you would be able to have these revenges. Like I uh, explained it in a video about the tower. So leave those points uh, until you have enough to reach some of your daily threshold my daily threshold minimum is 100 best one is 150 so basically let's summon up keys 13 plus 7 20 31 40 59 uh, 59 89 uh, 70 uh, 76 so it would get me to here. I'm gonna leave it at least it, until it gets to 100. Then I will, will collect all the keys and to, uh, wait till end of the day and see if I, uh, there is enough keys to get to the level 150. If not, I'm gonna leave them. So basically, I'm leaving this so people would be able to attack me. First, let's do the store. Uh, I'm not spending these uh, purple uh, elixirs on... Uh, quantums because you need elixirs to upgrade this one and as you can see i'm still missing 4000 elixirs for the next level so that's it but let's let's spend some accumulated attacks on a defense and always go for the last ones because they can disappear uh, get uh, too low and disappear so the last one is this one Oh, perfect 15 attacks i will be able to get purple chest and like i said attack always the the lowest one first okay 51,000. is this the best team yeah i have automatic options so 
one second and battle is done lowest then highest then highest okay now i'm thinking about attacking the most uh, the strongest team and just look for the highest numbers and there could be their best team as you can see 76 the highest one because uh, i have my heroes has uh, have recharged as you can see their mana is at maximum maximum and also almost at maximum so my team is ready and it's usually for me this let's say it easy to win yeah it said 80 something and i got 110 you will get at least this amount of number that's written here but you can get more not sure why that happens but it's always good okay let's go for the gold uh, strongest one 64 59 then and 35 now let's go for this one Oof. Sorry, wrong one. 62. Always the strong one, then the weaker ones. Only on a first attack, you attack the the weakest one first, so you your heroes would recharge for the next battle. Okay, and that's it. Let's collect the rewards. Yeah, nine quantum credits. That's silver quantum credits. Quantum credits and event items. Oh, nice! Some potions. No potion this time, but credits, quantums, and event item, and purple chest. Ooh, 200 million, two million purple quantums. Yeah. Okay, that's it. Uh, how many points do I ha still have left? 15 only. Okay, let's see. How many points do I need for this one? 11. Yeah, all, all uh, mines are active, so let's attack. First, lowest ones, yeah, 19,000. Easy win. Okay, then we go for the highest numbers. Uh, 76. Uh, as you can see, my attack uh, power is 101,000 points. When my... Uh, uh, heroes are recharged it's no problem to take out i don't know let's say 30 percent higher number than your team so if i see enemy team with one thirty thousand power and my heroes are recharged i'm comfortable that my team will win so uh, when your hero is recharged count as 30 percent stronger uh, than uh, what the number says okay collect rewards collect rewards yeah, I still have one revenge uh, left, but I don't have any points. I'm not buying points yet. Why? Because when I'm done with uh, all my daily activities, as you can see here, I could get uh, some attack points from this event. We'll collect this a uh, little bit later. Also, I have already here some points also collecting them later on. So what's next? Yeah, uh, next is uh, let's collect rewards from Alliance Battle Pass and Battle Pass. In Battle Pass daily tasks, some are done. Okay, and Alliance Battle Pass collect, claim, claim, claim. I get more points because I have Alliance Battle Pass active. Uh, as you can see, I have chest to collect, but I'm saving that one for special occasion if needed those extra 300 uh, quantums to get uh, over top someone at the end of the event. Yeah, collect this. This is quantum's chest, universal quantums. You get this from uh, when you have uh, Alliance Battle Pass active. Yeah, I forgot to collect log login rewards. As you can see, my progress is unbreakable so far i'm doing like 170 days without uh, failing <coughs> excuse me uh collect daily rewards gems yeah every day just log into the game every day and collect rewards as you uh, progress you will get better uh, rewards uh i think this is the the final rewards the three legendary chest every 10 days and you get some extra rewards over there 
Uh, what else? What else? Uh, we finished tower. Yeah, relic temple. Uh, as you can see, I have a uh, relic uh, waiting here, but leave it. I'm leaving it because sometimes in battle pass you need to uh, craft a relic to be able to finish daily task. So I'm just leaving there. I have plenty of relics, so I did really don't need that. Uh, on market, I'm because I have plenty of uh, red uh, shards. I'm buying one to three these chests when some events are active. As you can see, I, there's possibility to get seal here. That's why I'm. Oh, this is the only reason why I buy some some of these chests. You don't have to buy it. It's up to you. Yeah, I got one, and I got some relic. Okay, let's buy one more and one more. As you can see, it gets expensive by each of it. You can buy maximum five of them. This is 280 and the last one, I think it's 350. Okay, we are done with that. Uh, I'm not doing star pet at this moment. Uh, here you do, you have option. Let's just check. Uh, restart. Uh, you need to restart it every day. Uh, this is the free ones. I'm not collecting because I'm gonna. I need to make a video for one uh, alliance member that uh, wanted to see how it's done. And you have five enemies, free five enemies here, but it's hard to beat all the five of them because they are all of them are stronger than you. Uh, yeah, uh, here you have champion skin part one. I forgot to do that. Uh, what's that? You need to upgrade. Uh, one of your heroes for certain amount of points. Uh, I'm upgrading my main heroes. Firstly, uh, where to upgrade them? Uh, choose your hero, main hero, one of the, your main heroes. Go to the skins, and as you can see here, this one is already upgraded. It's 33 out of 50 uh, levels, and I don't have enough green ones to upgrade it. I'm just checking. Yeah, this one I'm upgrading. Need yellow ones and, and blue ones. I'm upgrading my mains to, I uh, let's say, twenty level 25 out of 50, if possible, if I have enough skin points. And I'll upgrade two per day, let's say. Two, maybe three, depending how far my progress is here. I upgrade to get these points and maybe unlock some rewards. Uh, that is done. Yeah, I know that some heroes can upgrade, but I'm waiting with that one also. Uh, where are we? Ah, Dell tasks. Let's complete. What have we done? Uh, open to arena chests. Yeah, just open to our chest in arena. Attack any mines that we, that have we done through revenge. We play the engine. Okay, let's now finish five hard. Uh, missions and three experts and total you need to complete 10 missions how i do that uh, i don't go to the campaigns because my campaign is finished at the moment uh, for the next one i need level 124 and i'm currently at 120 uh, 114 so there's uh, not uh, anything to do in the, for me in campaign i go to my heroes and trying to upgrade them which heroes i'm upgrading first Firstly, I'm uh, doing my top five heroes, and they are already upgraded at maximum. Uh, this is one of my main heroes. You can see there's still uh, spaces left for three uh, items, but for those, he needs to be higher level. So I'm not tr even trying to get those items. I'm just trying to get items that uh, my hero can uh, equip immediately. Okay, since my main team is uh, already upgraded to the maximum, let's go for other heroes, and this this one should be. Uh, one more equipment missing. I click on it, go to the recipe, and see, uh -huh, okay, I need these items to make it. I have this craft. As I said, I, uh, as you remember, I said I need first five hard missions. Okay, let's choose hard. I have options for automatic. Maybe you do, maybe you don't. Depends on your account. So five missions for this. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, claim. I finished five on hard. Now I need three on expert. One, two, three. 
Yeah, that's it. That's two quests done. And you need a total of 10 missions, which means another two missions. So when I'm done with Hard and those three experts, I do only expert mission because I, let, I think it's best to play expert missions uh, regardless energy spent and amount of credits uh, or, or rewards. So this is my 10 missions done for the quests. As you can see, done, done, done. What is next? Fight in arena 10 times. I fight star farting arena when my uh, when my chest of soul is active. So in 26 minutes I will start fighting in arena. Uh, enchant any piece of equipment. Let's go. So which equipment to enchant? On your main uh, heroes enchant uh, all equipment to the maximum. Constantly have them on maximum. On other heroes depends if you have. Uh, extra credits, extra items to upgrade. Since of all my main heroes are uh, enchanted, and my second hero, some are, some aren't. Uh, for example, here I didn't enchant this one. This one, I don't know why. Okay, let's just do it. But usually I upgrade only the best ones, uh, especially this that gives extra health, extra health. And since I know this guy is physical, uh, all physical. Attack, physical, critical should be upgraded. So, I don't know why I didn't upgrade this one yet. So, let's upgrade it. Firstly, I spent these options and then I spent my uh, items. Uh, if you don't have this one, spend items that you have the most. For me, my threshold is uh, items that I have over 2000. Th those I spent. So, as you can see, I have. 2407 of these. I would spend only 407 on each enhancements. You can also enhance lower ones, but like I said, enhance uh, items that are on your main heroes. Yeah, with uh, higher levels, it requires a lot more points to maximize it. Don't spend diamonds. Never. Never, 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 never. Be careful not to click on this one. So, 407 of these is ready to spend, but like I said, I firstly spend this and saving my items because you never know when you're right, you're gonna need your item for your uh, hero upgrade to make uh, some of his weapons. So, what do I do? Uh, this one gives me plus 80, I upgrade it to the maximum, and I withdraw one. As you can see, uh, I'm at 280 out of 300. With another 80, I meant maximum, but that's a waste of extra 60 of this. 280 plus 80, 360, but I need 300. So at the moment, I'm 280 out of 300. I either uh, spend uh, 20 of these because this one, uh, 10 of these because each of these gives plus two. You have plus three, plus four, plus six. Uh, like I said, spend just. Put yourself uh, some threshold. Maybe for your threshold would be 100. Everything above 100, I will spend. And usually start with lower ones, plus ones, then go for plus twos, plus threes, plus fours. I wouldn't recommend using the last ones that you have because there are maybe some crafted items for your heroes. As you can see, this one gives plus 320, but I have only one of it. No way I'm spending that. So, just put yourself, uh, make yourself some number, and everything about that number, you are using it for enhancement and things. Okay, uh, I done with this. Like I said, firstly I spend this, then I go to the items. This one, and for uh, 20 more points, which means 5 of this. Okay, it's at maximum byte, as you can see, it costs 2 millions each. So, I enhance only one equipment per day. Just for for uh, this quest okay it's done now let's go to the what else yeah uh mercenary harrier hero to your alliance go as you can see i have some heroes since i have my perks i can uh, hire three heroes i usually uh, give these three heroes to my my alliances this this and this because they are very good in every event that we get Okay, it's done. 
just hire it, you will get coins over there. And maybe someone will take your hero so you get extra uh, coins. Open five chests, it, it will be done in four hours. Start mining resources in the tower. That's collecting this, but like I said, I'm waiting till I have at least 100 keys to collect, and then I will finish that event. Uh, okay, complete the expedition stage. We'll, uh, we'll do that later. Okay, let's go to the islands. These are three islands. Let's start with Time Portal. Since it's Sunday, both of them are unlocked. And I always go for the last one. Can't fight the next one. I have opportunity to automatically battle. And I have five attacks, so I do five auto. Also, I'm spending the, uh, here diamonds. It's up to you if you want to spend spend it or not because this is credit wise and i need a lot of credits when i level up okay let's see it for 40 60 i'm doing 40s and 60s and that's it this one is done for me next one okay again five automatic i have automatic on all uh number of attacks depends on your progress in alliance Pass, uh, your perks that you have as uh, rewards are four to nine those big uh, potions and this one I'm always looking for so definitely spending diamonds here how much you diamond spent it's all up to you how much you can afford I wouldn't recommend but I know my daily threshold of spending uh, diamonds is what can I do to stay constantly around around this same number because i have extra 150 from that perk that i bought uh, don't mind my energy that high because for me to do all the, this i need to, one hour maybe two hours so basically i would gather small amount uh, of energy so i'm losing i don't know 10 energy because i didn't spend it on all of all of uh, fit in advance for uh, usually i always keep my energy under my maximum so it will gather over time we are land of trials also unlocked because it's sunday let's go i have seven attacks here let's see the rewards uh i see that um, one of these five items is at the moment needed for my uh, hero so definitely i will do one more run uh, I mean one more run, um, one more buying with diamonds and since my, yeah, finally I got it. When you see green ones, that means you uh, your hero could equip that item with, uh, that needs to be crafted. 60, let's do it. 120, I'm not, I'm not paying, definitely. I will tell you where do I spend 120 and only once in a while yeah i'm uh, just rushing through everything so it won't be too long video 60 okay attack okay that's it for this one magic depths yeah i know this uh, opponents in these islands can be tricky somehow not uh, not your regular team can beat all of this for some uh, bo boss let's call it bosses enemy teams you need specific specific uh, team setup we'll talk i'll talk about it in some other videos okay now this 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 island i like the most sentinel island entire portal time portal one of this uh, gives Credits, bars, and other gives potions. I love those too. I'm here only for credits and potions. And in Sentinel Islands, you get potions and credit plus some items. Uh, here, sometimes, when uh, there is event active, uh, let me check if it's active at the moment, double items in Sentinel's Island. Is it active? Is it active? No, it's not. Uh, sometimes there's an event. Yeah, uh, it would be it would be here two x, 
two times Sentinel Island. That means you have double items in here. So when it's doubled, I go over, uh, I do 120s also. Since it's not, I'm gonna do only 40s and 60s. And one more six. Okay, that's it. Okay, runs over there done. Let's collect quest rewards. Daily quest rewards, sorry. And start collecting this chest, bronze chest. Crap! Silver one, some quantums and some diamonds. Purple quantums, diamonds, credits and uh, seals. Okay, we have done this. What's the fight? Ah, uh, expedition. Let's go to the expedition. Oh, I forgot. Pets first. This is what uh, I will explain pets in another video. Uh, for me, I'm doing only this. First, doing the red one. This, the 12 of this and one summoning stone. Just choosing five lowest hero possible to choose and I'm doing only uh, the yellow ones this yellow requires 78 percent and this one does uh, eight one firstly go with higher ones eight ones and choose lowest one heroes okay five heroes and another yellow one again choosing the lowest ones in video where we are going to talk about uh, pets I'm going to explain why and everything Okay, and that's it. I will come back in four hours, uh, three hours to choose another ye uh, yellow ones, and in another in eight hours to choose another red ones. Um, I don't attack these green ones. Waste of time because they give only one one point. Yeah, we are at the expedition. Let's go for expedition. Firstly, on store. But uh, since I have plenty of expedition points, I spent some on these items where i see dot and my threshold is 2000 points so i'm buying this since i need it it's blue blue green or yellow i buying it if it's under 2000 and now for the this ones also doing it for 300 oh let me click never mind 300 i set up this number just for myself you can go higher, you can keep it lower, maybe you don't have enough, so it doesn't matter. Also, as you can see, I have free refresh, one of my perks. Let's do it. Again, firstly, going up here, everything under 2000 I'm buying. Ah, this is a little bit over 2000, so, and I need those. I'm buying a little bit over 2000, but blue ones, okay, buy, definitely. 3000, nope. 3000, nope. Okay, that's it. Quantums, like I said, up to 300, 300, up to 300. I'm saving these coins not going furthermore. You never know when quantum events, uh, not the Alliance, the solo ones are active. Then I spend a little bit more if necessary to get in top three uh, in that event. Okay. Uh, we, are fin we have finished the store, Let let's start uh, taking. As you can see, I have four attempts. Yeah, yesterday I haven't been able to finish this. You cannot believe it. That, has said that didn't happen for me. I can't remember the time uh, when I didn't finish it. Uh, as you can see, most of my main heroes are dead. I quit up. Uh, let's give it a shot with another run let's just put five random top heroes one pet maybe i'll get lucky no i lost so many teams on against this i didn't even want to uh watch uh why my heroes are losing who is that good i don't care i just continue to attack with another okay it doesn't matter Okay, let's rest her because new day. I have four attempts uh, regarding. Uh, I got four mm, uh, alliance battle battle pass, uh, alliance battle pass, regular battle pass, and some perks gives me four attempts. Okay, let's restart. Uh, I tried uh, this one, and for now it's a little bit hard for me. Sometimes I win, sometimes I lose. So I do 
the second to the last. As you can see, I'm already an expert. Only few few of them left. So the 99% of the time I'm winning all the battles here. So I go for that one because this one has 68 opponents. Yeah, two more opponents, more means two more chests, little bit more crates, a little bit more of this. But this one is faster and easier for me. So I go this. And how I do uh, that? I go all the way around first and then go in the middle. It doesn't matter, either this way or I go this way. So let's start. First, tech, I need to put my main team. Uh, I have automatic battle unlocked, so you won't see that much of here, just some results. Sometimes my team gets killed. Uh, why I don't uh, attack this immediately? Because maybe somewhere or further my team will get lost and I will attack need to recharge my heroes first before being able to attack those further ones. As you progress, the enemy teams become stronger and stronger. Yeah, this is something like tower, where your hero are pre-recharged on your next attack. Uh, don't mind me, I, I'm not uh, watching uh, rewards, what I get. I'm just uh, going through as po fast as possible because it takes time. Especially when you don't have automatic attack, I Im can imagine how long it takes. Uh, I remember me doing, uh, before I got that perk for automatic battle, how long it takes to beat, I don't know, 10 enemies. Let's click. And i done my circle, now I fight the hardest ones first, which are always at the end. As you can see, level 120, that's maximum threshold for this uh, uh, expedition level. And I firstly, when I die circle, I just finish the attacks and then I collect my rewards. I will do only one run, so this video would be shorter as shorter as possible. Collect rewards from all these chests. In some uh, gold coins, you get uh, gold chest. You get uh, coins, and in some you get arena uh, expedition points. Fifty are fifty percent are gold coins, and fifty percent others are expedition coins. Okay, once the chests are collected, collect the main chest. And here I get coins and ah, everything. Okay, claim. I have three more attempts I will do later after I'm done with this video. So basically within, and I would continue my attacks expedition every day. Towers, no no re new revenges, even though I don't have any points. Star pet, let's say I'm, I did that. Uh, what else is to be shown? Reality pink temple we did, pets we did. Uh, at the moment I'm not doing bastions because for me it's waste of energy. I'm waiting for the tournament to come up. There, there I fight. Mm, uh, quests. We finish. Comp oh, this one. Like I said, arena attacks for chest of souls. Waiting in eight, will start in eight minutes, which is also good because uh, we have alliance chest active event and platinum league active. Oh, Alliance War is over. Let's collect results. Yeah, we finished fifth, uh, first. Okay, where are the rewards? Rewards. Ah, they haven't put it yet. Okay. Uh, what's left? Now, let's see what rewards. Spend energy, spend diamonds. Okay, new, uh, new rewards. Uh, this why I said I spent only two uh, uh, skill symbols because I knew it's gonna be enough for the next level of rewards have I've unlocked something else yeah another chest with universal quantums here uh, another event's done what's here oh right coins need to collect right coins and my alliance doesn't have enough 
points to start rate. Okay, we are done with those. Let's collect this one, seals. Then, hero skill points upgrade. Nice. I always need those. Runes. Okay. And did we manage to get somewhere? No, not yet. Okay, this one is done. Let's spin the wheel for extra rewards. Two fifty green ones. Yeah. Not a great reward. Skins skin points again. I'm looking I'm hoping to get other rewards than skin points. And again, okay, that's it for for now. What else? Okay, let's go to the marketplace and sell our items. As you can see, I collected 43 million so far in those bars. Sell those. Also, like I said, in marketplace, always buy potions. Buy them. Okay, let's see what do we have in items. Some relics. Okay, I don't mind my most of my heroes has relics let's see if we can upgrade one of my runes i need 16 okay we have four over here and need 10 more here okay one level done don't click this one be very careful okay rune upgrading done let's see what we gather for heroes oh most of the time i just go first hero that's shown up here i do uh i put uh, items that i collected in the meantime playing okay let's fuse it uh, this is not my main hero so i just use fusion every time i i have opportunity again fusion you need to know what your what's your main heroes what's your secondary hero and what's your heroes that you Ever don't that you don't use ever uh, for nothing they're just collecting dust okay equip everything eh, and that's it no more uh, possible upgrading heroes now I ho have only skill points to distribute again going from the top to bottom and looking for the first hero that I can uh, that can use skill points that needs skill upgrading and that's this one again like i said i do the 10 by 10s it doesn't matter you can put all your points in the single one then go to the next i like to keep it like this okay that's it uh there's only thing one thing left left for me to do it that's arena text which will start in three minutes and spending energy like i said i spend energy whenever i go from top to bottom first your main account uh, main heroes which are mine all upgraded this one is my main this one this one this one and this one as you can see only uh, yellow stuff left that means he's not uh, high enough level after that i go from top to bottom till that hero uh if that hero has blue ones available, I go for that one. Or you can go for any hero you want. It's up to you. Uh, and here uh, I did my main quests. So basically I can spend energy as uh, I like. Like I said, recipe, I go for the items and just do the expert ones. Uh, I forgot to mention, I have automatic battle here. I'm not sure for, for, for let's say, uh, if I click for 10 automatic, if well, I will get equal amount of items. I'm not sure, it's hard to tell, but you will get definitely 10 times experience if they would get clicking this button 10 times, or, uh, but I'm not sure about items. That's why I go single by single, usually, uh, usually, and I don't claim, I claim when my item is upgraded when i see a blue dot uh not blue dot uh, yellow or green dot that means you can uh, use that item to upgrade some weapon but i'm i'm not gonna do 
all 2000 uh, in this video i'll do it later this this uh, uh, this video is going to be a little bit shorter than my usual run because there's plenty of stuff uh, for me to do uh, later on and i really don't like this or don't want this video to be two hours or three hours long now i just like to collect uh, click here just to remove uh, the thread dot notification okay let's say ah, one more minute I, we're gonna wait till we are waiting is there anything else left for me to do uh daily quest says fight in arena we'll do this now open chest waiting for that start mining waiting for that how much till next free chest 11 minutes this chest is gonna be available in one day it's it's crap chest because only zero to one quantums but this chest is good because you have possibility to get two to three legendary heroes quantums. not possibility you get every time from each chest you get two to three legendary heroes plus some free quantums don't spend diamonds don't spend diamonds too expensive uh done 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 uh not playing bastion phantoms we are collecting for this we are waiting till the last day as you can see almost two more days left pets we did relic temple we did tower for now we did expedition we did only one run but more will come star pet i'm gonna do yeah just waiting for arena okay eight more seconds and i will do just two victories to get those two chests i don't win all the time most of the time it's 50 50 let's say maybe a little bit more than 50 percent for me to win in arena because there's plenty of uh, stronger teams that i fight and in arena i don't have automatic options so let's do it i mean i don't have auto battle to skip i have auto uh, to use skills uh, this yeah defeat never mind let's go for the next one sometimes i win sometimes i lose overall i get a little bit over 50 percent at the end of the day there are some days that time i lose my point ranks but overall little bit progress per day okay one victory a regular chest don't forget uh, through your phone you can watch a video to unlock one chest immediately uh, save that video for gold chest or purple chest or even blue chest don't use it on uh, these crap white ones i mean crap compared to the others it's crap okay defeat it doesn't matter if i win or lose as, as long as i'm killing someone to unlock this chest of souls on my runs i do uh enough attacks just to unlock all those chests i have like i said i know three or four so i need to 105 or 140 souls or kills in arena to be finish my runs in arena it takes some time this uh, this part of the game is the longest one for me to get all those souls souls okay no more spaces left let's finish attacks in arena for now yeah nine more souls uh 19 more souls need as you can see i still have some rewards here to collect i'm saving that uh, those for the rainy days when i need attack points in the tower also i have one chest here saved but i need to collect firstly this so i would be able to collect this one so definitely waiting for this 18 attack points to uh be needed in the tower still nobody attack me if ah yeah i could could uh, use it now for this revenge but no i'll leave it for the rainy days okay let's say this summons up this uh video for today next uh next video about uh, with my gameplay will be on next sunday also so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up don't forget to hit subscribe button to stay tuned up with all the uh, new videos that i put on also if you have any questions feel free to leave them below 
uh, down below in the comment sections. And thanks everyone for watching and see you soon.